Hello, welcome back to another video on my channel, today we will learn how to make cups in Blender. This tutorial is going to be very easy and totally beginners friendly, and all of you can get the final blend file for free on my Patreon or Gumroad. And if you are new here and love my work, then you can subscribe my channel so you are always updated of my new upcoming videos. Well back to Blender. Delete the cube. Shift A, bring in a circle. Tap to go to edit mode. Now E to extrude. Yeah this much looks fine. Now Alt select the bottom vertices. E to extrude and then scale them down. F to fill up the blank face. Now go to the modifiers tab and select solidify. You can change the thickness from here, I am using 0.5, you can use any other value as well. Now bring in a subdivision modifier. Increase viewpoint level to 2. But if I go to the edit mode now, I won't be able to get proper results. And even if I take the subdivision modifier upward, you can see it's totally not we want. So to make our workflow easier, we will apply the solidify modifier. Right click, shade smooth. You can see we have a clean mesh. Well we are going to make the handle now. Control R to do a loop cut. Bring it above a bit, but don't go too far. Do the same for the bottom part as well. Shift select any two faces, now E to extrude. You can see the mesh is looking blocky, because it needs more geometry on the handle. We will simply turn up the subdivision level to fix it. Now I will be showing you two tricks to get your desired look, it is totally up to you to choose which one do you like. Shift D to duplicate it. Back to edit mode, select the front and the back face. We can not just scale it. So what we gonna do here, is to extrude it once by pressing E. Then we will scale it down. You can see it's going inward as well, while we are scaling it down. While keeping both the faces selected, right click and select bridge faces. You can see we made a cup handle by just doing few simple steps. We can even modify it further, like scale and even move it. But always remember the axis you working on, I am working on Y axis, you might have it on X, so you have to work along its X axis to get your result. Now for the other cup. Select both the front and the back faces. E to extrude. But this time press S, Shift X, to not be able to create depth, and it won't go inward, again if you are working along X, then you have to press S Shift Y. Right click, bridge faces. You can see, we now have a prominent edge. And we can modify this one as well. It looks done, but still I will do one more step. We will bring another edge loop. Yeah this looks more better. Now repeat the same process for the other cup. You can even check auto smooth for both of them. Now go to the materials tab. Click on new. Now choose your desired color. Lower the roughness to something like 0.2, don't go to zero. Now bring in a plane. Time to bring in any HDRI to light up the scene. Well this is what we have in EV, and this is Cycles. Well bring in more area lamps, light up your scene, set up the camera and you will get beautiful renders as well. Well this is all for today, hope you learned a lot. If you did then please like the video and subscribe my channel, the final blend file is available totally free for all you guys, 
you can get it from Gumroad or even on my Patreon page. Thanks again, see you in my next video, take care till then, happy blending.